hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to make a custom spinner like the one you're seeing here okay a spinner with a custom view that is added on a list view where you can add an image uh, and test view as design it as you want okay so let's open sketchware and we are going to create a project Okay, we can call it pro, uh, spinner. Um, spinner two, because I've created something like this. Well. So um, now, here I'm going to add, um, I'm going to add this linear V, linear vertical. Then I'm going to add a spinner here. Okay, then I'm going to add a list view. Okay, then I'm going to add a custom view. I will name that CUS and in the custom view I'm going to add a linear horizontal and image view add an image view then a test view okay then I'm going to center um, sorry for that I'm going to center this uh, vertically okay Now we're going to go back and link the list view with the custom view. Now that is done. Then the list view we can hide it by setting the height to zero. Okay. Now we can only see the uh, the distance, the spinner. So here we're going to go to on create. We're going to create um uh our list view map. Okay, we call that map. We're going to create a variable because I did something with a variable, a number variable. We call that num. That's number. Okay. Now go to the list view. We're going to add this block, but I think we're going to do a repeat on that. Repeat it twenty-five times, or thirty, depending on how many uh, times you want the list view repeated. So the li the key is going to be let's use a a key um a key uh um let's let just use key as the key okay and then the value let's um use go to the oppre oppression oppression block. And then we use join the con concatenate block. Then we join and um, to strange without decimal. Let's use to string without without decimal. And then we put the number variable. Okay, because we want to increase increase the the numbering. Okay, yeah, like that. So we see um, item. Okay. So it's going to, and then we're going to start the numbering from uh, from one, okay? The number should start from one. So since it starts from one, we go. We need to increase the numbering every time. So since it starts from one, say item, it will now say item number one, then it will increase. It say item number two. It will increase till you get to item number 30. Okay, then we go to the view and we add a custom uh, list. Okay, we say set uh, list custom view data. Then refresh the data. Okay, so we put all of that in list view one. List view one and then we select map here okay then we're going to add a block uh, and add source directly block this this block is going to help us um put the the list view in the spinner okay we're going to go here i wrote the code here i think so um maybe i didn't so what we are actually going to write here is Spinner one. 
spinner one dot set uh, adapter okay then we open bracket we say new uh, space list view list view one adapter okay this view one adapter then we're going to put the the map the name of the map list we're going to put map and we cover a, a double bracket because we we have another bracket here too okay i think that is that is just it there's no there's no much code and then then we go here to um on buying custom view so what we have to do here is to the view we're going to set the test to the key at each position okay so we will say list view uh, get value at uh, position get value at position key key and the map i think we are done um let's try and run that and see how it is running installing okay it didn't show anything i think there is an error somewhere so here okay here we didn't uh, set the map to the list that is it so then we run it again okay here we have it done item one item two it keeps incrementing in every list until it gets to item 30 okay so i hope uh, this video is useful and it's going to be helpful i think um if you have questions about this you can put the comments in the comment section below and i'll reply okay i'll see you on the next one